Yo guys, what is going on and welcome back to a brand new WWE Supercard video episode 59 with me cool guy and you the awesome viewers. In the last episode you guys got to see how disappointed I was in not making the final of the King of the Ring and not getting myself an ultimate card. And, um, well, I'm still quite angry about that, but I've entered another King of the Ring since, and uh, I will show you guys how that is going real quick before we get on with the episode. And you guys can obviously tell what we're doing today. Uh, schedule, and this is it. Um, I'm not having been doing too well, especially got a couple losses here while I was sleeping, which it happens. Sometimes you don't, sometimes you manage to get all wins, but... It happens. Anyway, standings. I'm actually not doing too bad considering I'm, I'm 9 losses and 14 wins right now. I thought I'd be like way down, but there's 3 really good people right now. And then we've got lots of people who are like at the kind of same stage that I am. Well, 2, 3, yeah, Night Hunter. Lots of people are like around where I am. I want to try and get into the... I want to try and get like 3rd. That's where I want to try and get to, but it's going to be quite difficult. We'll see if I can, uh, I can stay... Uh, Awake and uh, keep energizing that King of the Ring, uh, at least at regular hours. Anyway guys, today I've got episode 2 of The Wheel. Um, I'm not sure what I want to call it yet. It's still just a normal episode of Supercard, but we're doing this today. There's an event out which I haven't started playing yet because I was exhausted. I went out last night, I came home very late and I literally just went to bed and I woke up at like... Five this afternoon, which is extremely late, and I needed a lot. I need to catch up on a lot of sleep, though. But anyway, I haven't started this at all, so I'm gonna start it with you guys right here today. If obviously we land on an event, which you guys can see right there on that purple spot, event is right here. But anyway, we are gonna go put it on uh, respin. I think we said was the default, and uh, yeah, let's go and do that right now. So uh, let's get our first spin of the day. Let me just get onto like uh, the main kind of menu of Superguard. And let's spin the first time today. Oh my god. That is insanely close to event. That is so close to event. I don't think you, I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but it's on ranked and look, if I move it a little bit more, you guys will see the difference. Now it's on event, okay? So it was like that pretty much and that would be an event so it's it is in ranked we're gonna play a game of ranked remember guys if we lose anything today if we lose any game we must go on the forfeit wheel if we land on forfeit wheel which is on the light blue we go straight to the forfeit wheel as well um now i have yet to compose this forfeit wheel like completely i've got a couple of ideas down i'm just going i'm just gonna wing it for now if we land on it then i'll pause the video i'll go take like you know, half an hour to go get dot down some ideas, and I'll come back. But I'm confident that we won't get a forfeit in today's video. <laughs> anyway, let's play against Aaron. Um, let's see what we can do here. But remember, guys, one loss is an automatic forfeit, which I'm not looking forward to because you know there are going to be some forfeits. There's you know I don't know how many slots there are on. I'm guessing there's yeah there's twelve I think. How many colours are there? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, so there's 14 slots on there. And that's a lot of slots. So that means there's going to be seven different possibilities. Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to do like I did here. Match the colours. So if it's wild for dark blue, it's wild for the other dark blue. If it's Royal, Royal Rumble for yellow, then on the other yellow, it's Royal Rumble as well. I think that's pretty decent. That way I don't have to come up with... 14 different things, and especially because there aren't 14 different things to play on Supercard, you know? Uh, ranked, Wild, uh, Royal Rumble, Money in the Bank, uh, the event, and then uh, <laughs> that's pretty much it. So that's why I had to come up with the respin thing, because, you know, there wasn't anything else. But I'm pretty, yeah, we've done this, guys. A ranked mode, a game successful. Um, very happy with that. No, uh, no, um, no forfeit wheel yet, okay? So that is pretty damn cool. Let's go ahead and get much. I'm not playing much of ranked at all, guys. The only reason I've got even a couple trophies um, is because I'm doing like this battle with uh, uh, with a really cool guy, D2. Shout out to him up um, over on Twitch. We do it. Uh, if you guys want to, oh by the way, if you guys don't know I stream, I do. Links will be found in the description as usual. I'll be streaming today as well. Uh, the event, some WWE champions, all that good stuff. And yeah, it's time to spin the wheel for the second time. Round and round she goes, where she lands, nobody knows. There we go, she landed on Money in the Bank. 
So let's get into a money in the bank game. I'm lying. I'm lying. It landed on forfeit. Oh dear. All right, guys. So um, I will be right back once I have the forfeit wheel instead of this wheel, and we can have a spin of that wheel. All right. I'll be right back, guys. And oh god. I'm not looking forward to this. Alright guys, so I'm finding it a little bit difficult to come up with these forfeit ideas, okay? I've come up with four so far, um, and that's pretty much all I've got. So what I'm going to do, and I, this might, you guys might not, you might not like this idea, but I'm not going to do a forfeit right now in this video. What I'm going to ask you guys is to help me out, alright? There's an awesome comment section down below where you guys can ask me things or do whatever you want with it and write to your hearts, you know, can't write anymore, um, hands, why did I say hearts, um, <laughs> so, I need your guys' help, write whatever you guys want me to do in full fits, obviously, if you guys write, go jump off a very tall building, I might just not do that one, I know that sounds crazy, but I just, I, I don't think I'd do it, um, and same thing, like, if you guys request me to, I don't know, eat my phone, I won't do that either. But if you guys request like reasonable forfeits, like like reasonable forfeits, make forfeits that won't cost me money that much, or forfeits that aren't gonna make me like throw up. I mean, there is a forfeit here that just may make me throw up. Anyway, I'm gonna just quickly tell you guys what I've got so far on this wheel. That way, you guys obviously don't um, request or ask, you know, or give ideas that I've already have. So the, the yellow is one that all of you guys will know. Well, all of you guys, well, well, this will be annoying. It says, buy Roman slash Spurs t-shirt, okay? So what that means is, if I land on it once, I'll choose between buying a Roman Reigns t-shirt or a Spurs t-shirt. Now, if you guys do not watch football, do not like football, then people who... It's like, like Spurs, aka Tottenham, are the Roman Reigns of football for me, <laughs> okay? Um, I'm a huge Arsenal fan, as you guys know. And Spurs are their main rivals, who we all hate. Okay, so I would have to buy, which I I prefer wear. I prefer to wear a Roman Reigns t-shirt than a Spurs t-shirt, one hundred percent, because I'm literally like it's it's. I I I I'd thought I would go my whole life without having to wear a Spurs t-shirt. But listen, entertainment, doing it for you guys. So if I land on it the first time, I'm buying a Roman shirt. If I land on it a t second time, I'm buying a Spurs shirt. And then obviously we'll have to wear them in the YouTube video. Um, we'll, we'll see how long, for one video, for a week, not sure. Orange is delete card. So what I'm gonna do is I'll just get, I'll just get like a random number generator and we will start from the, um, where is it, from the Samoa Joe, okay? Now, yes, I'm starting from the Samoa Joe. I'm not gonna delete Ultimate, Ultimate Pros. It's just ridiculous right now. And most of you guys would probably be triggered if I did that anyway. So, I'm gonna start from the Samoa Joe. We're gonna go down all of these cards. Um, Naomi and Ember Moon, I'm debating if they'll be up for deletion. Uh, special cards are not up for deletion, and then obviously all my Ultimates here are indeed up to be deleted, and all my Elite cards here as well. So. That's what we'll be doing. So that is that. Now, pink. I had to come up with something, so I decided to put mess up King of the Ring. I need to mess up my King of the Ring for not one, not two, but three games, okay? So when I land on it, I do it straight away. I don't be like, oh, wait, wait, not this game. Then afterwards, I've got three easy games. Let me do it then. No, I must do it straight away. And I'm struggling in this King of the Ring. So, well, struggling. I'm like, like joint fourth, but like, you know, like... The guy who's in six is only like a game behind me. So anyway, um, that's pink. Uh, purple, I think you can call this, is probably the most entertaining for you guys with the, I suppose it's a delete card. And I suppose, I don't know. But this one is probably, my, I'm going to regret this at one point, but it's a challenge. And then just here where you guys can't see because there's a reflection of the light, um, it says cinnamon slash milk. So if we land on it, we need to do a cinnamon challenge first, and then if we land on it a second time, we need to do the milk challenge. So if you guys aren't aware of the cinnamon challenge, you get a teaspoon of cinnamon, boom, eat it, and uh, and it's not always great fun, you know, it's not it's not fun. I've done it once or twice, I think, before, and no, not, not I think, I've done it once, I'm not sure if I did it twice, but I definitely did it once, and I, <laughs> I got cinnamon all in my keyboard, because I was a wanker, and I did it like, I like spit it out, well I didn't spit it out, you just cough, and it all comes out, and it was like facing 
my computer is my old computer back in the day. Uh, the milk challenge is you drink a gallon of milk. That's it. You drink a gallon of milk. You've got an hour to do it. I've never done it before. I've read some reviews. People saying, oh my god, you throw up all the time. It's so difficult. Come on, mate. A gallon of milk. Easy. I'm calling it right now. I would like that. It's easy to do. So, what that means is I've got one, two, and three spots left, okay? Green, uh, light blue, and dark blue, okay? If you guys do eventually suggest more, I can fill out all of these as well. I don't have to duplicate the, um, the forfeits on the other colour. So, for now, I'm asking just for three ideas of forfeits. Knowing how awesome you guys are, you'll get that done. Um, very easily for the next episode. I owe you guys a forfeit. Don't remember. I, I do. I'm not just pretending I don't owe you guys a forfeit. I do owe you guys a forfeit. We'll do the forfeit, but as soon as I can fill this wheel up, because I'm not going to spin the wheel with four options, because you know what? I don't like these options very much, but hit, there are some pretty severe options here. Special up like buying a t-shirt. That's easy, like $30. Um, deleting card. That's pretty heavy. I mean, I've worked for these cards. Um, or I spent money for those cards, and uh, the cinnamon challenge and the milk challenge, that's, uh, that is quite, you know, yeah, it's so, you guys don't have to request like horrible things, like just things that are like, oh, uh, you know, they, just, 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 just little challenges, they don't all have to be like insanely crazy, making me throw up, making me die, or, or you know, deleting my whole account, it, just, just, just normal little challenges, you know, because there are, couple here that are quite big already. Maybe, you know, maybe out of the whole wheel, maybe another one, maybe one or two more big ones, but maybe a bit, a couple mediums and small ones as well. But anyway, that's that, guys. Um, we're going to leave it here, which is a very short episode, and I'm going to play um, a couple uh, bouts of RTG. Now, I only spun the wheel once, and we played a game of ranked. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it here, just because if I land on forfeit again, it's going to cause a lot of confusion, and it's not going to be very good. So, you guys can leave in the comments, as I said, look, some, some uh, ideas for forfeits, okay? And in the next episode, I will review these comments, we'll talk to you guys about them, I'll decide whether, obviously, if I want to put them in or not, because at the end of the day, I get final say. <laughs> um, so, and then we'll see that, and we'll probably, for episode 61, um, while the RTG is still going on, we'll get you, I'll get you guys a, another, a proper episode of The Wheel, so you guys... Um, don't hate me too much for like cheating you guys out of an episode today, I suppose So um, let's play some RTG uh, Late start to it as usual. I always have a late start to it I always find some way or somehow to have a late start to my RTGs. It's always it's always like that But we should be okay guys. We should be good. I'm gonna get the mankind I'm gonna get him pro uh, It's gonna be my fourth event card, which is gonna be really really cool I'm hoping the next event card is a wrestler I like more then Mankind, Bret Hart, Nivel, um, cause yeah, and there's no, you know, probably the one I want the most, the one I I've wanted the most at this point is probably Shane O'Mac. Shane O'Mac and Neville, and Alexa Bliss, um, but, yeah, I hope it's a wrestler I really liked growing up, or, or just a wrestling, an active wrestler now, who I really like, but, we'll see, obviously, Kurt Angle would be the dream, I would freak out if it was Kurt Angle, he would be my, my number one priority, um, just like safety is your number one priority. <laughs> if you guys didn't get that, it doesn't matter. Um, uh, da, 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 there, Neville. Neville. If you guys are Australian, say Neville. And do you guys say it like Neville or do you say Neville? N Neville? Neville? Hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. Big shout out to the fat boy. Because he, he chucks some shrimp on the barbie, mate. Uh, if you're watching this fat boy, admit you speak like that. Admit it. Admit you say shrimp. Chuck some, chuck, wait, chuck some, yeah, you say, sh no, I've had this debate that, like, Australians say prawns, not shrimp, and the whole stereotype of them saying, you know, shrimp and the barbie, that is just not real, like, you know, New Zealanders, New Kiwis, that's not, that's, that's what you call New Zealand, people from New Zealand, Kiwis, not New Zealanders, Kiwis, and that's actually true, by the way, if you guys didn't know that, you actually call people from New Zealand Kiwis, like, the fruit, and that's not a joke, I thought that someone was just, fucking around with me, but no, that is genuinely how you call people from New Zealand, a kiwi, it's hilarious, but like, the stereotype for people in New Zealand is obviously they like to play around with sheep, and they like to, you know, you know what I mean, when I say play around with sheep, they like to, you know, you know, you know, so, 
Yeah, stereotypes. Now, that's another question. If you guys are from a country where, you know, not everybody is very familiar with, or let's say you're not, like, from the main countries, and you guys have, like, some kind of stereotype that people talk to you guys about, and it really annoys you because it's not true about your country, and it's just a stereotype, then say that in the comments. Say where you guys are from, say the stereotype, and say that's not true. Just like people think um, in... For example, England, we all drink tea at four o'clock with our little pinkies up and then we like like this, all posh with some scones. We don't, all right? We don't. Some people do. Quite a lot of us do, but we don't. <laughs> no, we don't do it exactly like that. We love drinking tea. Us Brits, tea is our number one drink, but uh, not 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 how you guys all imagine it, you know? Not 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 like sat up straight with a little poodle in, in the handbag and the little finger up. No, we don't, we don't do that. We do not. Um, I hope this is not too too much of a short video. No, I don't think it is. I, I did ramble on a little bit with the wheel and everything, so I hope this is a, a good sized video. I will bring you guys probably tomorrow. Now I'm gonna now I think about it. I'll record it today, but I'll, I'll upload it tomorrow, which is my career episode two. Thank you guys for you know for for those who enjoyed it. Thank you for for supporting that video, and I hope you guys will support the next videos to come and. Uh, the WWE Champions, I will be recording that as well tonight, and that will be up either very late tonight, because this video is going to go up as soon as I finished recording it, so this video will be up around, mm, what is it, 7.30, so it will be up about 8, quarter past 8, 8.30, and I might release a WWE Champions uh, video about like 3 or 4 in the morning, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. I might record it, schedule it actually for like, nine in the morning. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I just need to bring you guys my career tomorrow, obviously a super cut episode tomorrow, and somehow I need to bring you guys a WWE Champions video somehow as well tomorrow. So triple upload. <laughs> triple upload. Uh power, let's go him. Let's go him. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Kevin Owens versus the million dollar man. Um, no that's not his name. What is it? Damn it. Teddy BLC. Ted DiBiase. Whatever happened to Ted, B Ted DiBiase in in, um, in WWE? Like, I, I don't know what happened to that guy. I quite liked him. I know he broke his hand at one point. I'm not sure if that was storyline or not. I, I just have this vague, like, idea in my head seeing him jump over a barricade attacking someone with, like, his arm, his, like, hand, wrist in a, um, in a... What's it called? What's it called when you break something and you, they put it in something? They put it in a... Oh, God, I hate when I forget words. In a cast. He had it in a cast. Um, and I'm pretty sure it was like, ah, oh, this is really weird. Like, when you have memories of these certain things, but they're really vague, and, like, you think, oh, they can't be right. I'm pretty sure it was, like, Hoonigo and this other guy. They came down, they were a tag team. They came down to the ring on, like, bicycles. And didn't you have, like, a feud with them? Wasn't that the last thing he did in WWE before he went? I'm pretty sure that was, like, right when I started watching WWE or something. I have such vague memories of that. It's really weird. Um, but yeah, Ted, that name Ted DiBiase just kind of brought that back because I watched the Elimination Chamber match that WWE posted a couple days ago, the 2010 one with Sheamus, John Cena, Triple H, um, Kofi Kingston, Ted DiBiase, Randy Orton. So that brought that, and that's why I thought about Teddy Boss. Anyway, there we go, guys. We've just got Randy Orton. I've just realised I didn't put any con I didn't put any uh, credits on. I haven't got any title matches. That's why it took me two games to get the Randy Orton. But we're going to do that now. I'm going to be streaming as well later on, um, as soon as I've had dinner. The video, the supercar video is uploaded, and um, maybe I'll probably actually record a my career episode while we live stream. I think we may just do that, but then I have to. I don't know. I don't know. We'll we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I'm so sorry that I didn't obviously get that you guys didn't get to see a forfeit. And I'm sorry that it wasn't a proper episode of the wheel, but I will bring you guys one either tomorrow or the next day. Um, don't forget guys, comment please what I should do as forfeits. As I said, they can be small forfeits. They don't have to be huge forfeits. Thank you guys for watching the video. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Until then, take care and peace out.